Hey everyone, it's Game Crow. Welcome back to Axiom Verge. In the last video, this game got super duper trippy and raised even more questions than I had before. So we're gonna see if we can't make some progress. No. And get a little more of the story. Find out what's up with this Trace guy. Apparently he was working on like redefining physics or something. Die already. Change guns. Stupid roly poly. Okay. Making headway again. I don't like anything I see at the moment. There we go. So there is up here. I can't, uh, I can't get to. Alrighty. Fine. And now we're above where that boss. Uh, what are you? You're not harmful, whatever you are. Yep, I have no understanding what's going on. The map's linked back together. I have. I have no leads. Wait, I do have an idea though. Floaty thing, come here. Okay, so apparently that's not what I'm supposed to do. above her chamber, but there wasn't. I don't have more passwords. I don't know any of the other languages for the reveal codes. Well, there's whatever's going on here. I don't know. So, let's look at the map and see where I need to go. Eden. Eden. I haven't really been to Eden. Um, Kerr, I've been through a lot of. I don't know if I've been through all of it. So, I guess that means I gotta go back to Eden. I don't know why in this area those get bigger, but I am not even going to complain. Because they're kind of more powerful that... Why did it... I'm not the only one that saw that, right? I dropped down here and it got all fuzzy. Okay, oh, it's not fuzzy anymore. It's just fuzzy right in that one spot. Okay. What the? Ow!
what I think of you, good sir. This is all changed, because these weren't... You know what? I almost sent my little dude to do this, because... Ow. This is why. No, I didn't want you to pick up the health, though. Whatever. Yeah, I probably could have shot all that stuff, but... Really wish I could get into some of these other doors. Apparently, that's not a thing right now. All this stuff has changed. Turn you into missing no to give me the giant bolt. Yeah, like I could get to these places if I could phase through those sections. So, boy, why is this room designed like this? Oh, I'm not hallucinating anymore. I can actually see the room for how it's properly designed. I get it. So let's run around a little and just to see what we find. better at handling those. Nope, still can't do it, so I can't get that power node thingy. to die, please, and thank you. Oh, what do we got here? Double tap to teleport in any direction. I feel like this is gonna be... Whoa! Oh! Yeah, this is gonna be nice. And I can do it while jumping. Holy crap, this coat is amazing. I think I can go everywhere. Well, except for the areas blocked off by the pathogen. Ah, you missed. Oh. Oh. You know what? I'm just going to prepare this gun. Because those things are nasty. I don't know 
they still explode anymore. Oh! Holy helpfulness! Stop killing me! Okay, just a secret, and we got a new thing. Our best conjecture thus far is that it is a forced relinking of the lattices underlying adjacent universes. The breach attractor, then, has some capacity to shift the points at which the lattices link. The region beyond the breach remains intact, as when the breach recedes, the atmosphere and surrounding ocean don't encounter a vacuum in its absence. Though there is a strong disturbance in the currents once the two sides meet again. Outside of a breach elevator, passing through the breach can be fatal. The Sudrans use this as a makeshift shield to keep out intruders, or, as in our case, to keep something else trapped in. Based on their writings, it seems that the Sudrans have long ago lost a scientific understanding of what the breach truly is, perceiving it as an intense meteorological phenomena rather than the divider between worlds. A7 hypothesized that the breach itself is invisible, and that the effect we see in the sky is in fact a protective field of microscopic elements covering the frayed ends. Okay. No, that's not how I wanted to do this. It's really not. Also, I think I have developed a resistance to these missing no guys. And... Wrong one. There we go! Just killing those guys makes me special or something. I see you! Why do I see you, though? That is the real question here. Okay, I don't know why that robot was trapped there. I give up. Oh, hey, I can get out of this area now. But I want to check this out, give ourselves a quick save to be safe. Cool. So this should take me into Eden, and it does. Neat. You should be, nope, a little more, there we go. Oh! 
I just teleported up here. Diagonal teleporting. to be at all. What now? So apparently there is something up there. That I cannot get to. Um. Alrighty then. Find a safe. Nope. Thought we might find a save room. Oh, that's not even nice. I'm not gonna make it. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Nope, I'm dead. Alright. So, that was difficult. I'm gonna go to the other side of that, and I'm gonna take one of the big heads, I think. Wait, where? Okay, I am an indie. That was water. No! No, I want you to go the other way! I mean, there could be something over here. I don't know. I mean, let's be honest. Why would you take me back to Erebu? No, there's nothing in Arabu I need that I can get to right now. Unless you want me to go to Absu, which also doesn't have anything useful that I remember, unless I want to go visit uh, Elsa Nova in person, which I don't think I have a reason to. 
Z have explored and haven't, there's really nothing there. Kerr looks like there might still be something. Then there is the save room in Indy, so... Let's go over that way. Hopefully find some more heads. Okay, cool. I figured out how to make the floaty head thing work. It goes in the direction I'm facing in. My life just got easy. Oh! Fantastic! And I can't read it. Okay, so we're going to see where this will take us in another video. We'll get a quick save and call it a day. So we're still not done with Axiom Verge. I've still got quite a bit to uncover, apparently. And we're not going to stop till we get all the way through the game. So we'll see you in the next video. Until next time, later!